guys how are everybody doing so I have my new product to share you can like my yellow fingernails <laughs> it, it's just a mess guys I did it myself so don't pay attention to it so better than just you know uh, dirty nails so <laughs> have some color it's not good but it's okay anyway so I'm gonna show you guys my new product so I hope I did not drop everything because I carry from the another spot to here. Okay, let me see what should I show you guys first, huh? Okay. You know what I show you guys? Um let me see. This uh mini alarm clock, just so cute, right? So this is my um uh, product company labeled it. I designed this. This one is a smaller one. It is a good size for my um, product, the small size, but I don't like the one like I have a big product. I don't think it's good, but I'm not you guys. So I put a chipboard in there. Okay, see how tiny that is the alarm clock. Not sure this is, you can see see their number there no anyway that one package is nine pieces so like this that one one there and then I have like a XO and then yellow so we can show you guys this see that I believe 12 maybe 12 in there I'm not sure 12 or 9 that one so you can use on your project okay, you can see I love love this one it's so cute guys so this uh, in a pack right there so it's back up with the chipboard this I don't think I can find any uh, color chipboard so it's plain chipboard not so much get attention but I think it label product pretty good and I have this uh, jet Polaroid here, so small size and big size. So your this pack is like total ten of ten of them. So it gets small uh, small frame here five, and the big frame is five. So total is ten. Let me show you guys one piece. See. Put that one back in there so I don't lose this somewhere. Okay, so that one right there, and then this one. Remember, uh, in this DT package, and I ship her the wrong wall side. I amazed that she still can put things together. <laughs> so, okay, so this one will be a shadow box. Um, shadow box with a drawer number two, same the one I call number one, and so this one will be number two. See how oh, you get that piece, and you get that one, and you get two pieces of this here. And this one will be a drawer part, so you can put. I'm so glad that I sent the wrong piece to Anin and she. I just love how she used it. That is amazing, guys. She just amazed me with her talent, guys. So, this one will be right there. And so, this one will be right here. So, you know what? This one, it look like a sofa or chair something, right? So like that and oh, anyway guys let me see it again so I have a rubber band here to help me just yep how I get that right so here we go sorry if my camera is shaking because I stand up and I lean on the table so 
and now I'll put it, the drawer. and put that one in there. Oop. Hang on. And if it does not fall off on me, put that one in there. Here we go. See? And you make your um, album holder lining that she used a holder frame to sit in there. I think it's really cool idea. I mean, I love it. So that's why I make the plain one. It is one really good because you can write on the sentiment like if you paint any color and then you write the marker color, any sentiment on this frame will be a really cool, cool idea. I just love the idea, guys. Thank you, Neen. Ah. So I think I might want to alter this and use my uh, Polaroids to make album lining this. So awesome. I cannot wait to do uh, You know what? I have a ton, ton list I want to alter. And, uh. Okay, I'm going to not put that one. Oh, see here my label right there. And then I have this is I think it's too small the, because I'm laying out of the this side label. See how that because this is for emergency, so I just you know uh, ran out the label so quickly. So I ordered some more. We'll get here a couple of days. So I like love this side. Anyway, so here we go. And this is a tea bags holder. Alright, so you get one piece of the base one. Let me move this one right there. I think I'm gonna put this one back in there. So I don't ma mess up with pieces and put the wrong again. Then you make sure the pieces still put it together for me. But I could love me my dear. So, okay, so this one is the bottom piece, and then you will get a this the wall piece, and then you get this the back piece. See the set tea bags there. I love it. So what you can do is you put that one right there. So the one have the hole in there, so for a door like that. I want to alter this for my guest house for the new house and in my uh, new house too. So I think I'm gonna use this. Make sure this doesn't fall off. So and then did one in the front, so a little bit shorter, so for you know can pull on the back. So I'm gonna put this one in here. Much bigger, can see. I turn this way so you can see. Oh, hmm. nothing to hang on to this. So, but oh, all right. So, see that it's so far right that, and this the lid is on the top. So you put that one right in there. Let me grab and show you guys real quick what it look like. Here we go. And for you can use any knob like I'm planning to use some like my uh, handle. Remember that my favorite handle so so you can lip to put your tea back in there. And now we're going to have some tea bag and drop in there. Let's see. Let's see. I don't know how many tea bags I need. Anyway, whatever you fill it up there, 
this is out on the top to make sure not don't overdo this otherwise you have problem open this lid but let me show you guys at the bottom with the tea bags down there see now people just you know put the finger in there and grab it back okay this is how it work all right so that my tea bags holder and okay and this one is just a uh, tree draw you remember my chest drawer but this one's just no part the top it's just just the shelf and the drawers let me show you guys see this label is too small so if i have this one it'll be a very good size but i use that one for now So you get back piece and you will get the divider shell four pieces as, you, as I tell you you guys before you have to separate pieces together first before you try to grab put it together that easier so you don't get overwhelming why too many pieces so you get three pieces of the drawer bottom and you will get the front three pieces on the back for the drawer you get six pieces the side of the drawer all right so i'm gonna put this one together for the shield part and then i'm gonna put uh, this side I haven't made a uh, storage as couple ladies request it yet, guys. Alright, I will get it to you guys this weekend. I hope so. So this is see just the uh, draw just it's no scholar part, no just, just the plain one here. Okay. And for your That's a little bit tight, you need to go adjust it, okay? And then for the wrong side doesn't matter I guess if you want to have the door not so this one have more speed like uh, the first one I did and see so it will not be too tight when you alter the drawer so I have people have a lot of problems have to stand and make sure there's not paint something too thick but this one is you go for it if not super thick to be fine not too tight see because I have more gap there and this side so that this one will be better all right so this is it. and then I have let me um, let me leave this one guys because I have the this drawer too but it's um, it have the top part okay and okay this is go back in there okay I'm gonna okay 
Okay, so this is so this is just uh, just the plain one, right? It's not top hard. But the three one that I made have the top hard. Like let me show you guys. It's the top of light. It's three dollar too, but it has the same top hard. So you get one back of those. And you get the same thing, all these four pieces of divider and the wall side. And let's see. Get all the pieces the same as it except this have one the the top piece there. Okay. So I'm not sure to eat. should I let me show you guys once this one and was shin on the back a little I think I'm gonna use the rubber band to make sure this one is not far off. Oops. I should leave that. So this one will be uh, and have the butterfly part in the YouTube drawer, the same drawer. That one right there, see? And let me see. Well, on the back piece, so I have the butterfly three doors, that's what I call the name of it. And then I have this one, it's a number there, the clock number. So I have this one in here, so you can use this one at the photo or something there, so be really cool. And try not to pop this one out. I was just so worried it's going to break when it, I chip this out. So this is... Let me see if I can take this one out before this one falls. So I just want you guys see how this one might look. Nope. Because this one I have to switch this side. Anyway, so let me see. Well, I have to swap this um, this side. Let's see, I have to swap this too. Because this one have to be faced this way, so we cannot. Switch this one only this piece, and you know it's all the same thing with the butterfly there. Mm. There we go. 
Jolla right there, see that? So I think I'm gonna show you guys that it only that the one I have the Roman number. See, this all the same with the, the butterfly top and this clock, and then the number clock. It is the same. Okay, I think I'm gonna go, guys. Is I have a lot of things to do. I need to be label stuff, but I'm trying to get all my product label if the possible. But I'm kind of did order new labels today, so. But that's it, guys. Thank you, everyone, for keep watching, and I will see you guys next video. I will after this. I'm gonna have to um pick the the winner of my challenges. So, alright, guys. Thank you, everyone, for keep watching, and I will see you guys next video. Bye bye.